If somebody sends you a workbook and they got a bunch of data that contains all uppercase or lowercase and you want to be able to convert it either to one or the other, you can go ahead and use one of two functions. For example, the first one is I want to convert this data all into lowercase. Just go ahead and find another blank cell. Hit equals on the keyboard. Type in the name of the function. It's going to be lower. Type in the first couple of letters. It pulls up the list of functions. And then you can read over to the right hand side. It says that this function is going to convert all the letters to lowercase. Once it's highlighted, go ahead and hit the tab key to pop open that function. You can see it says, okay, what text do you want to convert all to lowercase, or in this case, what cell? It's going to be the one that contains max cleaner. Go ahead and select it, hit enter. There you go. It's all converted to lowercase. And vice versa, if you want to convert Bob Appleman all to uppercase, just go ahead and type in equals in a blank cell, and then start typing in upper. There it is. It says here it will convert everything to uppercase. Once it's highlighted, hit the tab key to pop it open. Go ahead and select the cell, hit enter, and there you go. There's one other function, it's called the proper function, and what that does is it'll take the first letter in each word and convert it to uppercase, just like you see down below. For two words here, Homer Simpson, the first letter is going to be converted to uppercase. Now since these already have it, we won't worry about it, but let me go ahead and delete these two. Go back up at the top, we're going to convert Max Klinger to proper, so only the first letter in each word is capitalized. Go ahead and type in equals, begin typing in proper, there it is. It says it's going to go ahead and convert the first letter in each word to uppercase. Go ahead and hit the tab key. Pops the function open. Select the cell. Hit enter. And there you go. So everything converted to lowercase. That wasn't supposed to be an uppercase, which is the first letter in each word. And then all I have to do, if I want to go ahead and have the rest of these names converted to the proper function, just go ahead and hover over the lower right-hand corner of the cell that contains that function. Until you get the black cross, click and drag, and it'll copy that formula. Or the shortcut to copy a function in any column is just hover over the lower right hand corner and double click really fast, and there we go. Now you notice that these cells contain functions and these don't. And I don't want both, but I do want the results over here. So what I can do is I can simply select the results and copy them and paste them over here. But I don't want to do a simple paste and paste the function, I just want the results of the function. So go ahead and Control C to copy that come back over here, select the first cell, and then again, I want to do a special paste. I just want to paste the values, not the uh, function or formula, so you can go ahead and right click on the first cell. There's the paste options. Hover over the second option there where it says values, or come up here on the home tab to the clipboard, click on the paste drop down arrow to the paste values category, and go ahead and click on the first one, and there you go, automatically updates. Let me go ahead and delete that. You can see up here in the formula bar, it's not the function, it's the actual value or the result of the function that we had over here. And everything is in proper case. The first letter of each word is capitalized.